I've had to face no challenges due to my gender or sex. Everything's been peachy, gravy, perfect. Everyone just accepts me. They just assume I'm smart and strong. They don't even talk about my gender at all. It's been absolutely fucking amazing. Five stars. Hi, I'm Mindy Raff. I am a writer, comedian, and actress based in Brooklyn, New York. How I started was doing musical theater for a long time, and then I moved to New York and started auditioning for musicals. So it took me a while to kind of evolve into my voice because I think I was performing for a gaze and performing for like an industry that was binary and heteronormative. And I think stepping outside that and writing for myself allowed me to find my own voice outside of any of those gender constructs. I think in general, women's stories or stories that aren't like cis, white, heteronormative stories aren't thought of as important a lot in different industries. So they're not given a clout or money or even like focus and attention for pitches. And I think that's a challenge to have to like start uphill to convince someone like the point of view that I have, the story that I have is important. And just for being in a room with decision makers who are often, it's changed so much now, but when I was coming up, were often white, straight, cis men, and they were making decisions about what is funny and what should be funded. And it's a huge problem across all industries, but specifically for performing arts and creatives who really need people to represent them. I think it's important to find people that inspire you and that you can stand behind what they're doing or what they're saying or what kind of art they're creating. I think the more different people are telling stories and putting their work out there, the better.